Lolly always exists, alright? Lolly needs to be there. Oh! Okay, now do you guys think this is huge or not? You gotta have a huge once in a while, alright? Apparently this is the website BGM, so let's see. I want, the title is quite unique, right? It's codenamed Cedar? Cedar? Which is in, in its own is kind of different, I guess. So you can see it's more of... It's very interesting, right? There's rockets, there's jet engines, there's tanks. Even though you can see, wait, is it is it AI? I feel like some of it is using AI. I don't mind it as much, right? They can use AI all they want. Stranger things, you like GB? Huh. GB lovers? This game is for you. If you are a GB lover, what are you waiting for, alright? It's time to rise up. Time to rise up. Cedar? Sounds like an actual operation name. It doesn't look like AI. Some of it, maybe not all of it, right? Like the background stuff. Hmm. But yeah, the concept might be interesting, depending. But then again, Girls Frontline exists. It feels like the game is trying to capitalize the same. I don't think this is the gameplay at all. If that was the gameplay, it would be cool. And what is just a CG, I think. Might try this out once it comes. Too much chibis, all must be destroyed. You think there's too much chibis? You think uh, it's more than you can fade them? Oh, is it a loop? Yeah, it's like a constant loop, right? So let's check out the, the characters, right? So this is the official website. So this is it. So that's the one that we just watched. You can see they got a pre-registration, right? So currently, only 334 people are pre-registered, pre -registered, which is very little. Make sure you guys pre-register. Try to get this to more numbers, all right? So this is the character that you get free 4 star if you reach the goal all the way at the end. Huh. It's gonna take a while. So these are the characters they were featured right here. What do you guys think of the design? How do you pronounce this? Trihamehemoing? Do you pronounce... How do you... Paikiana? Okay. Russian names. Boktok08. Okay, very cool. Satrap, is that how you say it? Reminds you of Arc Knights. Design looks decent. Satrap. This one, this one I can't pronounce. That's like impossible to pronounce. But yeah, the character design doesn't look bad, right? If you look at it from this perspective. Who's the developer? I have no idea, man. It's a new up and coming dev. The Russian propaganda is look at this Russian waifu. Russian is waifu. Mapka. Okay. I wonder why they, why are they going with Russian names, right? Is it to appeal to Russians generally? But then it's not global for now. So I don't know why they go in. And this is Bak... Bak... Baknanka? I assume. Okay. I assume this is the faction, right? You can see it says Joint Development Region. Okay. It says Bok Tok 08, whatever that means. The only one that's different is this one. She seems to be from a... From a different faction altogether, right? Oh, so we got a priest design. Okay. 
Yeah, this design is pretty cool, right? They hot. They are all from Russia. Yeah, most prob most probably, right? Cute anime girls in the depressing escape from Tarkov extract shooter will be cool. Not sure about that. Hmm. So Kaik na. Ooh, so they got some lollies. Okay, lollies are important, all right. Lollies balance things out. Went Wenton, is that how you say it? Pioneer service. Very interesting. Okay. Right, right, right. So you get more, more and more of a different, different variant one. <laughs> a lolly game ruin. What do you mean game ruin? Lolly always exists. All right. Lolly needs to be there. Second. Oh. Okay, now do you guys think this is huge or not? You gotta have a huge once in a while, alright? So huge is important and therefore... There we go, huge! Alright, you, you need at least one huge, right? You can't just have the soldiers. So you're gonna have some revealing outfits once in a while. Okay, not just one but to Koba, finally. A normal name. Okay, this two looks good, man. Yeah, these two, the design looks actually looks good. I feel like they are better than the, the other ones, right? What else? Okay, now back to the... Yeah, I think the character design has a lot of potential. But it all depends on the gameplay. The character design can only carry it so far. Yeah, I kind of like... Uh, the lollies are like whatever, but I kind of like this one. These two. Okay, let's see if there's some screenshots. So you can see somewhat. It's going to be chibi, right? It doesn't really matter. Let, let's be honest, right? In the end, it's just going to be chibi. Chibi is going to be how it is. Can't wait for a ga gameplay. I'm almost LB3, your character. Okay, nice. So this is how the gameplay is like. Let me see if I can zoom in for you guys, right? So can you guys see? Wait, is it like Blue Archive? Okay, except that there's grids, right? You place them beforehand. And then there's cost. Two cost, one cost. And then you can use the skills. It could be like a combination of BA and Neural Cloud in terms of the gameplay, right? It's something that we'll have to see. The real killer. So this is a character interface, alright, very typical of uh, most gacha games. Uh, okay, so a, a bunch of them shooting. And that's just a regular home. Yeah, this is the stuff that we have for now. 16 plus. Wait, why would they want me to open in Microsoft Edge? Okay, let me see if I can observe anything else from uh, their official channel. Wait, is this a gameplay? This is your official channel, by the way. That's it. Okay. Huh. No gameplay. Alright. If Lolly disappeared from all content, I wouldn't lose sleep. Sure. Spinning chibi. <laughs> this is a gameplay, guys. You pull for this. Yeah, there's only two videos, which is this one and the other one is the, the usual one that we just saw. But yeah, hopefully uh, we'll get more, we get to look more into this when it comes out, right? But very, very interesting design.